Okay, you guys, I just needed to make a quick disclaimer for the video that is about to go up. I am in no way a professional anything when it comes to skincare. I just do what works for me and figure out what I need to. I'm not a dermatologist or anything like that. And I'm not telling you to go buy or try or use any of these products if you have sensitive skin like myself, I, there have been times where I have broken my skin out so bad from trying random products. I do have sensitive skin, but I have been using Dollar Tree products and Dollar General, Family Dollar, Walmart, like discounted skincare all my life. I do splurge on skincare from time to time at Ulta, but if I have a skincare system that I feel is working and my skin is good, then I don't bother with spending all those hundreds of dollars, which we know it can get to. So, I'm just telling you guys what I'm doing, what is working for me. If anything changes, if they stop selling these products, then obviously I will have to find new products, and I will. Sorry, you guys. That's all. I hope you're having a great day as well. Now, let's get into this video. I hope you guys enjoy. Hey, you guys. I finally have my little setup here my new little film area where I'm going to be trying to film most of my videos. Sometimes I just whip out my phone and film when I can. So, but this is like my little setup area. This normally goes up under, but it's up there right now. This is the setup for right now. I'm going to get like some cute little drawers to go up here, probably from five below in the Dollar Tree. But today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what's in my skincare bag. I also have an empties video coming from you guys. And some new products I just purchased. But this is just what I'm using right now. Besides my face wash, that's actually in the bathroom. Because I will forget to wash my face. Okay, so the first thing is actually empty. And you guys know that I love this. This is the White Tea and Quinoa Facial Moisturizer or hydrator I say moisturizer because it moisturizes my skin very very much upgrade dull skin with a blast of moisture and loving ingredients honestly I really do love this stuff it's hard to find it since Dollar Tree did their upgrade it is so hard to find but I have a few of them anytime I find them I buy as many as I can find because since they have upgraded it's hard it's really hard to find them um and this is the one i'm currently using which you can tell i actually do use it now this is my bond this is the rejuvenous anti-wrinkle cream firmer skin in two weeks honestly i love the way this makes my skin feel this one is completely empty like, this one is completely empty. I have another one I just bought. So, when I run out of my current one, which is the blue. I also use the pink. I love ponds. And this one has a good bit left in it still. So, since it still has some in there, I'm not going to open the other one. And that one's not in my little area. It's in the closet so that I don't, like, open it and use it. And this bag is old. I need to get another one, but it fits everything. Now, this is from the Dollar Tree as well. This is the Cucumber Seed Oil with Caffeine Awakening Eye Cream. Honestly, I do like it. It does. Like, I put it on before I do my makeup, honestly, because... My concealer lays over this so beautifully and it doesn't crease or anything like that. I do have more of these. I just need to put them in here. I'm almost done with these. These are the cotton rounds. I get these from Dollar General. I just prefer these. I don't know why. Um, I also have this 
Global Beauty Care Glowing Vitamin C Facial Serum. Now, I've tried many of serums, like a lot of them, and I do not like any of them. My skin is very sensitive to them, and I do not know why. Like, I don't know if it's because of what I use for skincare, or I just need to find one cohesive brand. What I'm using right now works. My face is not broken out, and it's not breaking out. So, when I find something that works, I'm very hesitant to change anything about the skincare. But when I went back to find another one of these, I could not find it. So I got the Global Beauty Care Serum with Vitamin B, C, E, and Niacinamide Serum. Now they're from the same brand. As you can see, I haven't opened this one yet because the other one is not going. But I didn't want to have no Vitamin C Serum because I honestly feel like it did wonders for my skin. And... So, that's where I'm at right now. Now, this is a soothing clay mask, pink, pink pineapple and grapefruit from Dollar Tree. And my face was just really breaking out, like, badly. And I just felt like I needed either a moisturizing or a soothing mask. And this is all I could find, so I tried it. And it actually helped, so... As you can see, it's kind of still full. I don't use it all the time. I have other face masks and things like that. Most of them, I only use when my face is, like, breaking out or dehydrated. Or I feel like I need, like, a little bit of, like, collagen or extra. Now, this is not so much for my face, but it's, like, an all-purpose cream for Vaseline. You're going to put it elbows, cracked heels, hands, knees. You can put it anywhere you want to. And this is because my daughter will steal this if I don't. If anybody remembers when they had the Pure Sonic at 5 like this is so old. It's like 34, maybe 5 years old. It finally, like, gave out on me. I did buy another one, but old habits die hard. It's really hard to, like, let this one go because, honestly, I love this thing. I use this instead of my hands to wash my face. I do make sure I clean it very good at first. I use this to wash my face instead of my hands, and that honestly does help with breakouts a lot. A razor self-explanatory and then this is my favorite elf palette ever that I've ever bought and I have refilled it it's a huge mirror first of all and then it's a highlight and then three shades of powder I love this thing I don't know why this is in here instead of with my makeup but since it's in here I'm gonna show you and then this, these two items are classified as makeup. This is a white eyeliner pencil. It's like mostly glitter. If you like, if you want your eyes to sparkle, but not get glitter in your eyes, th this is awesome. I have to, rem find, I have another one in the packaging, so I can tell you guys where I got it from, but I have to find it. And then I have some nail clippers and a pencil sharpener in here. And then I had a coffee body scrub spill on this, so that's what that is. It's not nothing weird, I swear. And, but these are like the little star face patches for when your skin breaks out. They still work perfectly fine. It just spilled a little bit. And I had to clean it out. I wasn't going to throw them away or anything. So, that is everything that is in my skincare bag. And then, if you guys want to see some new stuff that I bought. I was trying not to buy these headbands. But I saw the mommy size spa headband. All the, all the little kid size ones were gone in my Dollar Tree. In the location that I went to. So, I got this one to start doing. 
my like face care <laughs> makeup wig, but I haven't opened it yet. And then I got these Bio Pure pocket size antibacterial hand wipes. I haven't opened them yet. I just grabbed them to throw in my purse for when we start going out and stuff for the summer or the springtime. But in my area, it still gets pretty cold. So that's a thing. Like it's cold outside right now. Like there is no sun. It is very cold outside. And that is all the stuff. I'm leaving the two items out that are empty i'm not throwing them away because i am gonna do a full empty video so you guys can see that i actually do use all of these products they really do work wonders for my skin they do help my skin a lot and i like to start by saying when i first started in skincare i used to use like the bar face soap Fizoderm, and then i would use ponds the light pink moisturizer and that's all I really needed to do like my skin wouldn't freak out or anything I didn't need anything else but obviously as I got older and my skin started to mature I did have to use more like moisturizers and stuff because I do get extremely dry skin especially during the winter that's where me using that white tea and quinoa facial hydrator came about so if you guys have any other questions let me know down below in the comment section and thank you guys for watching today i can't wait to upload the video so i can show you my full little area so it's like a little birthday present and I know it's not like a vanity area. I didn't want a full vanity area because my kids are attracted to makeup and stuff like that. And I didn't want something that screams, yeah, come grab and play with me. I have a toddler. No, thank you. Also, I just, I would never sit at a vanity area. This area I do sit in. I do my makeup in. I do my skincare in. I talk to my kids. They sit with me in this area. They play with lip gloss because I did get like a little shoe rack. That's all that she young is spilling for right now. So I hope that you guys have a great day. And sorry I've been gone so long. One of mine got sick and I had to like spend time taking care of her. So I will see you guys in my next video.